Okay. Welcome, Ruth. Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> cool. Hey there. <laughs> I've just been. Uh, news. <laughs> This I've just been asked about this the space suit. I don't have it with me, but maybe a, a Mordek hoodie does a job. <laughs> <laughs> I'm disappointed. Uh, it's too warm. Sorry. Out yeah. from out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. <sighs> okay, I'm going to give the stage to you, okay? Yeah. Closing awesome. sentence. All yours. Bye bye. Could you pop my slides on there? There you go. Wonderful. Thank you. Okay. So mm -hmm. here we are. Can you believe we are at the end of Morticon, our first Morticon? And it has been such an awesome event. Um, I think you'll agree. We, we've got a few thank yous that we need to say first. Um, in terms of this event, I don't know if many of you are aware how many people were involved in this. So we had 320 attendees. We were running six tracks with 65 sessions, 59 speakers, seven languages, and way too many time zones. I have lost track of the number of people trying to find out what time moves were happening in their time zone. So, I mean, I think that is just such an incredible achievement for the first year of our conference. Um, yeah, I think, would you agree, Becky? I, I think it's totally incredible. It's, it's way more than, than other communities have had after many events. And uh, I, I did lead some, some tracks over the day. I had three occasions where people got confused by the various time zones. And uh, I'm really proud of it. Yeah, and I just want to say a really huge thank you to all of our sponsors because we wouldn't have been able to do this event without the support, but also the money that they've paid towards their sponsorship is going directly to support the community and it's giving us a financial foundation that we can grow from. So I'm going to mention some of them here. So our gold sponsors, we've got Acquia. Facet Interactive and looked for a digital marketing. Did I pronounce that right, Effie? Excellent. <laughs> getting better, getting better every day. <laughs> and our silver sponsors, so Drop Solid are the team who built the website, morticon.mortic.org. They've done a fantastic job. Higher Education Marketing, Akalono, who did all of the design. So they are responsible for our Mortinort and all of the branding and everything you've seen design wise. And the training sponsors as well. So OS Training ran two training sessions yesterday, which were really popular. And again, it's the first time we've done this, so we weren't really sure how many people would be interested. But they've really done an awesome job. And even Rob Martin, bless him, wasn't very well at all, and he still managed to do both the sessions. So huge appreciation for their support for the community. And did you want to talk through some of our community sponsors there, Eki? Sure. Um, I love the fact that we uh, came up with the, the notion of community sponsors, so make it really uh, a lightweight entry into being a sponsor. And we had multiple of them signing up, starting with Web Mechanic, PowerTick, ooh, uh, oh, eat, eat yes, but what's the next one? Can you help me out? Make web better. Oh, of course, yeah. Oh, our friends. <laughs> GZ EVD, whatever that is. Oh my God. I need to size up my screen here, I guess. <laughs> and Softacular. Yeah. Uh, Accelerant. Accelerant. Yeah. Stencil, and then there you go. Yeah. So, big thank you to everybody who has contributed to uh, sponsoring the event and helping us run our first Morticon. Oh, and it's online been... business duplicator.com, right? Yeah. Well, them, so shout out to them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And also a big thank you to our amazing speakers because obviously a conference without speakers, yeah, just wouldn't work. So uh, there were so many, I actually had to make this like quite small print. So these are all the speakers that we've had throughout the day. And I also want to um, shout out to a few of our speakers who unfortunately weren't able to present today. 
couple of our speakers had family emergencies and weren't actually able to, to speak and had to pull out. So we really hope that your family um, recover and we hope to see you next year. But thank you for your help and for your willingness to speak. And Ruth, so, amazing. I think this is not even complete. Might, might that be? So maybe it's just um, my name is missing, but but maybe there's more missing. So apologies to everybody. Oh, on the list. that's my fault then. Sorry if I've missed a couple yeah. of people. That's even more. That's good news. There's <laughs> even more. Sorry. <laughs> And also, uh, this event definitely would not have been possible if it weren't for our amazing working group. So these are the people who stepped up and said they wanted to help us run Morticon. Uh, Morti and just for some context, in case you weren't aware, we kicked off this process in our kickoff call on the 18th of May. So that was seven months ago. And we've had 45 working group calls in that time. So these people have come together 45 times and so many hours of work behind the scenes by many people. So some people in this list might have just contributed a few things, other people have contributed loads, but together it has made a huge difference. People leading tracks, people getting involved in uh, social media, and people just helping us with ideas, for example. So yeah, huge thank you to everyone who helped in this way. Oh, and once again, there's important people missing, and that's that's your name, Ruth. <laughs> it should be in super. Okay, I'm um, totally. <laughs> And if this was a, a real physical conference, we, we'd uh, yeah. come to you with a huge uh, bunch of flowers and with some serious alcohol. <laughs> and <laughs> I promise we're going to do that once we can. <laughs> we'll figure it out somewhere, yeah. somehow. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it, it, huge thanks to everyone who has been involved in this. It has been really, really amazing to get this, to, to bring the community together um, around an event like this, and particularly to have so much interest in our first event. And also, I've seen a lot of people talking about the event platform and saying how much they appreciated and enjoyed using it. So the platform is called Vietly, um, and they have been absolutely outstanding. They've put up with so many emails from me. Can we do this? Can we do this? How, how can we do this? I can't work out how to do that, you know, and um, new features that I've been bugging them to have and then they've brought in and I've been super excited. And they've also been helping me out with some issues today when people have got locked out or we've had problems with people connecting. So big, big thank you to the team at Vietly uh, for their help with this event. Also, it's open source. So if you ever want to run a conference and you've got the technical chops and the infrastructure, it's on GitHub. Just so you know. So I guess you're probably thinking, OK, what next? You know, what do I do next? We would love it if you could give us some feedback about the event. So this will be going out to all attendees. And also, there'll be a broadcast message with the link. Um, we'd really love to hear what you think went well, what didn't go so well, um, if there are things that you think we could maybe introduce or do less of next year. Um, so please do take the time to give us some feedback. We would really love to hear it. And then also, just get involved in the community. And you've probably got sick to death of people saying this over the last 12 or so hours. Um, but yeah, do you want to take over here, Ricky? Because you're the community team lead, so. Yeah, I guess it speaks for every team. and They all can use your help, whatever your specific skill set is, whatever your specific time budget is, whatever your, your specific um, area of work is. Uh, it, we appreciate it all. Everything is helpful. A slow start is completely okay. Um, and also, people are really, really friendly and welcoming and helpful. If you want to get involved, we'll help you get started. So you're going to find your ways. The, the things that get, got presented today during the keynote by Ruth uh, have, have had a very, very big feedback and splash in the community. I think there's going to be a lot in, in that area. So watch out for that and, and make the first step. Yeah, absolutely. And like it says in point three, if everybody who came today, so all 316 people, were just to give an hour a week, that would be 316 hours a week of contribution time that would go towards making Mortic awesome. 
And I don't know about you, but I mean, I have a pretty crazy schedule, but I can manage to squeeze an hour a week in somewhere, whether that's in my work time or in my personal time. So, yeah, yeah, please do have a think about it. Maybe have a chat with your team at work and see if you'd be able to have an hour on a Friday for Open Source Friday or something like that, um, yeah. because it would make a big difference. Yeah, and when you, when you look at the variety of, of people presenting today and topics being presented today, um, I think that's very encouraging for everybody that you don't have to be a rock star or, or a super nerd or anything to get involved and to be really helpful. We need, we really need every skill set, every level, mm -hmm. even, um, even a complete beginner can be super helpful. Uh, so don't be shy, um, find your spot and it's going to be great. Yeah. And finally, like if you genuinely can't contribute, there have been times in my life where I was commuting four hours a day and there is no way I could squeeze an hour into my life. You can tell people about Mortic. So you can share what we're sharing. You can tell people, you can even speak about it at you know events or anything like that. That is another way of contributing to the project because that tells people about it and that brings people in. So don't think like that's not an option. You know, that's just as valuable to us as having people contribute. Yeah. So another next step, we would normally go outside somewhere and take a photo and that would be our first ever Multicon photo. And I'm gutted that we're not going to have that, but we have the photo booth. If you haven't been to the photo booth yet, you can do just what it says, press a button, take a picture with your camera, have some funky or some um, designs and stickers and things like that to play with. Um, and you can Snap it for posterity, download it yourself, but it will also go into our gallery, which looks something like this. So this is the Multicon photo booth. So you'll find it in the fun stuff section, which you may not have explored because you may have been so focused on your tracks that you didn't go anywhere else. So now's your time to go after this session is finished um, and snap your picture. And then maybe we'll have a full mosaic by the end of the session, who knows? The event's going to be open for a little bit after we finish the, the track. So if you want to chat in the networking area, you can do that. Um, so, yeah, I really like the photo booth. You know, like, I'm biased, but hey. <laughs> um, so I guess the next thing is everyone's wondering, well, what about next year? And I think the thing is, well, watch this space. And th I love that pun. I just realized, sorry. Um, we don't know next year um, whether we'll be virtual, whether we'll be in person, whether we'll have a hybrid account, we, uh, event, we just don't know. So what I would say is just make sure you're following us on social media, join us on Slack, keep your ears open because there were a bunch of people who didn't manage to get tickets because they wanted to buy tickets today and unfortunately we weren't able to process tickets whilst the event was running, we just didn't have the capacity to do that. Um, so buy them early next time <laughs> and yeah we will let you know when we have a date for next year and if you'd like to be involved in the team and you'd like to help us organize then all the better uh, we would absolutely love to hear from you from that so that's all yeah. from me Eki is there anything else you would like to add yeah I do, do think that this Mordicon has been incredible Tremendous success! I, I would ne never have dreamt or dreamed or whatever it is <laughs> of of uh, so many great uh, talks and, and so many attendees, etc., and such such good discussions too. And I think it's it's very encouraging to do to build on this for twenty twenty one. And as you said, uh, or as we discussed earlier in the uh, earlier in the panel. Um, having this as an online thing was fantastic but we also can't wait to see each other again or for the first time or mm -hmm. whatever so it's going to be an interesting mix next year next year but i also want to point out that there are other events both virtual and and uh, physical events from mortic camps meetups uh, all the way to sprints so watch out for those events there are other ways to connect to people but this Mordicon as the central event for Mordic, uh, I've been waiting for this for years and I'm super happy that we made it today. 
So we made it happen. Hooray! Well done. <laughs> okay, no. Yeah. Fantastic. Okay. I think that's everything then. It is. Super. Thank you very much, everybody, for attending. Yes, thank you so much for involving. Global chat asking with people missing song sessions. When will the recordings be available? Okay, so the recordings. It takes quite a lot of time to process that many sessions and get them up onto YouTube. So if you would like to see that happen sooner rather than later, we would love to have your help. If you have a computer and you would like to help us with rendering the videos, realistically, I would say at least a week or two before we get them on YouTube. I'm sorry if that's not good enough. If it's not good enough, step up and give us a hand. That would be amazing. Yeah, agreed. Cool. Cool, then okay, I think we're done. Yeah, in, in Asia, they're already tomorrow. <laughs> Over here yeah. is late. On the other end, it's not as late. But uh, it's fun with the, with the time zones too, and uh, I'm, I'm glad we made it. So, see you all soon. Yeah, okay. Bye to die. Safe travels. Be well, everybody, even though we're not traveling anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers.